tastes like fish. Oh, that is nasty. Hey guys, welcome to Nigel's Cheap Vlogs. Hey, good morning everybody. Okay, welcome to another Nigel's Vlogs, Nigel's Cheap Vlogs. Today, we're traveling Air Canada and we're making our way to London Heathrow. Economy, four of us. That is our aircraft today, a Boeing 777-200 series in the old library of Air Canada. Hello. Hello, bonjour. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, zone 3, unfortunately a lot of people with Zone 6 were trying to get into Zone 2 and Zone 3 because people can't read a simple boarding pass. Sad, right? Good morning, 39A. 39A, straight down the side. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning. All right, we made it to uh, our seats here in the, uh, the cattle class of economy on Air Canada. Uh, last time I flew, I sat slightly further forward uh, in the preferred seating. Mind you, I was traveling on my own and not with a family of four, so it was justifiable. Uh, but with four of us, you have to get the cheaper seats. Uh, because upgrading would have cost me like another thousand dollars for the four of us in total. In fact, we looked at upgrading to business class and it would have been uh, $9,800 uh, for one leg for all four of us to just go to the front of this plane. Anyway, this uh, flight is, these seats are going to exactly the same place. So uh, we'll just grin and bear it. It's only six and a half hours. So yeah, we can handle that. Okay, we're about uh, an hour and 20 minutes into the flight. Uh, we've now just received our meal for the flight. Uh, there's been no drink service. Um, we took off just after nine o'clock, it is now 10.30. So an hour and a half has gone, no drink service. We did have turbulence for about five minutes, but uh, they've gone straight to a meal service, which is a breakfast. Uh, Tegan next to me has a pancake, and I've gone for the omelette. So uh, let's have a look, see what it looks like. Okay, so on my plate, I have a lovely little uh, omelette. Yeah, it looks like some uh, little, little home fries in there. Some kind of sauce. 
raspberry yogurt, bread, butter, jam, a little bit of fruit, and some water. Uh, Tina's going straight for the bread and butter, safe option. And I can't see what her pancake looks like because it's still sealed. But uh, there you go. And the butter is not spreadable, but we're not going to complain about that. Tastes like fish. Tastes like fish. Oh, that is nasty. That is not what I expected. It actually tastes like fish. Not the egg. The, uh, the marinade around it. Yeah, I've got a fishy undertaste for that. I don't know what it is. I'll give that a miss if it's for bread and butter. The problem we have right here, this, it's still frozen. So I don't know how I'm gonna get it on the bread. So, oh, I'm gonna, a little bit out. I'm trying to eat, it's pretty much, pretty cramped. It is a, a very small space. I was quite comfortable until I started eating. And now I'm like, hopefully claustrophobic, like I just want elbow cheeking in the head kind of thing. Like that. I need this meal to be taken away so I can have my coffee. You're not eating your pancake? It looks better than my omelette. It looks better than my omelette. One thing that does stress me out, uh, we got served an hour ago our breakfast and I do suffer from anxiety. So one thing that really gets my anxiety triggered is being sat like this for an hour. An hour, I finished my breakfast an hour ago and I still got the plane. It's like I'm cramped, I'm squashed and uh, I want it gone. And my anxiety levels are now getting up here because I need to just move, I'm feeling so crammed in. All right, here we are, we're at uh, about five hours into the flight. Uh, we've got another little sandwich service coming around, uh, which is kind of good. I'm getting a little peckish again, a little thirsty. So uh, anyway, overall, the last five hours or so, flight's been pretty good, uh, quite, a, quite a bit of turbulence. Uh, we're currently just approaching the uh, west coast of Ireland, so about another 90 minutes to go until we get to Heathrow. As we said, we booked this flight in economy, uh, there's four of us, and uh, today we used Air Canada just basically uh, due to convenience, you know, basically convenience. Uh, this is a daytime flight, which was nice, left at 9 a.m., uh, gets to London at 9 p.m., and so I don't get there too tired, which is what I've always hated doing. Uh, a few years ago, we did take United Airlines on the daytime flight, but we had to go via Washington. And out of all the flights I've taken transatlantic, that was the worst one. Uh, my favorite flight to date in economy has to be with Delta Airlines. It's still the best. Uh, we did uh, Toronto, Detroit, Detroit, Toronto. The service was fantastic. The flight was great. We had no qualms whatsoever. And very easy to get around the airport as well uh, at Detroit. As for this particular flight, uh, it's been pretty good. Um, so we booked economy, these four of us. I paid, the flight started for about like 800 bucks and it quickly became 939 each uh, with our luggage allowance and seat selection. Funny enough though, you couldn't have your seat selection until 24 hours before boarding. 
Uh, but we got lucky when I randomly just checked online. They did a sign us four seats together about two weeks before we flew out. Pardon me, a bit of a burp coming on. So uh, there you go. So for, for four of us, it's just under $4,000, uh, which is a lot. Now, like I guess I did, if I fly on my own, I quite often book the, yeah, the seats up front uh, with the extra leg room there, the, pre the preferred seating. And it's usually about $100, $110, and that gives you all the leg room. That seat is much better, and I'll do that again on my own. But we're a family of four. I've had to sit here cramped up, and I'm getting really restless now. I can't move, I can't stretch, and um, yeah, economy sucks. It'd be nice to be rich, wouldn't it? to land here at London Heathrow as you can see it's night time um, the time right now is 5 to 9 UK time uh, the advantage of taking a daytime flight which I love this is the biggest advantage of this particular flight is uh, it's only 4 p.m. Canadian time so none of us are tired we can be able to get our car rental do some driving so tomorrow we'll be fresh no jet lag whatsoever Thank you for a nice service. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, so that was it. That was the uh, Air Canada flight economy to London Heathrow. And uh, yeah, that's it. It's uh, 9.25 in the evening. And that's it for this video. We'll be returning on a low budget airline. So that should be quite fun. We're flying back on Air Canada Rouge. So make sure you check out that video at a later date. Until next time, don't forget to click like and subscribe. And uh, more Nigel's cheap vlogs coming up in the near future.